Hello, I'm Trending, presented by your bison. Getting wild live coverage since ever. AT&T gets sued for making a commercial with Progressive's Flo character worth $10 billion. Flo is important to my daily life. Speaking of commercials, they are now banned to all fans of the Sooners. Makes plenty of sense. In other news, President Trump begins work on the wall around space to keep out the aliens. We need that wall. And fans are left shocked with the heartbreaking breakup of Justin Bieber and the alien queen from another planet, Serena Gomez. And all this time, we thought she was from Earth. That has been trending. Back to the show. Welcome, everybody, to Club Talk. I'm TT, and this is Johnny, and we may be done. We have to warn them of that? Today's episode is all about being dumb. Or smart. Huh? We're taking a smarter dumb test. But before we can take this mentally unstable test, we need you to, s- to subscribe your undying loyalty to us by hitting the like button. Because we're trying to reach 1 billion subscribers, or I'm trying to reach 1 billion subscribers by the end of this year. So, contribute. Now. Loyalty? To the club. Oh. Okay. We'll do the entire test with just you. First question. Okay, then me. First question. How many different months have exactly 30 days in 2008? Um, let me think. I don't know. I wasn't even alive in 2008. A farmer has 17 cows. All but eight die. How many cows does the farmer have left? I haven't even been to kindergarten or preschool. Which country is largest in terms of landmass? Can this be a multiple choice question? Test? Thingy? Right! That would be important. How many different months have exactly 30 days in 2008? Four, five, six, or seven? I'm gonna go with six. The farmer has 17 cows, all but 8 die. How many cows does the farmer have left? 11, 9, or 8? There's no numbers. I'm gonna choose 8. Which country is largest in terms of landmass? Spain, Peru, Italy, or Austria? Alia. Austria. Austria. Something like Spain. That. Which? What is the approximate average height of a full-grown man in the U.S.? Six foot three, five foot nine, five foot six, or fifty-five? With a little squiggly line in the middle. Five foot six. In what year did the U.S. declare its independence from Great Britain? 1776, 1492, 1976, or 1942? 1776. You finished all the candy, blank, for one last piece, which he gave to me. Except with an E or except with an L? Uh, except with an E. Alright, which is worth more, one pound of dimes or one kilogram of dimes? Um, one pound. What date does the 4th of July fall on in Russia? January 1st, July 4th, December 31st, or October 12th? Um, uh, October 12th? What hotel chain is Paris Hilton most closely associated with? Merritt, the Ritz Carlton, Hilton, or Comfort Inn? My personal favorite. Uh, Hilton. Who is the current Prime Minister of the United Kingdom? Gordon Brown, Margaret Thatcher, Queen Elizabeth II, or Winston Churchill? Sounds like Margaret Thatcher. What is the square root of 9? 81, 
21, 18, 27, or 3. Personally, I don't think there's an answer to this one because 9 is not a number that can be, you know, turned into a square. 81. The blank of his injury was to prevent him from playing any further. Effect with an E or effect with an I? Effect with an E. There's only one letter that actually makes sense. What time do you have to get up if the drill sergeant tells you to wake up at 0600? 6 p.m., 6 a.m., 8 p.m., or a silly dot with a 4 and a P and an M? 6 a.m. Which of these cities is the capital of the country with a coastline on the Mediterranean Sea? Tokyo, Oslo, Rome, or Venice? I'm thinking Rome. Which is greater? Half of one-fourth or one-fourth of half? One half of one-fourth. Which distance is longer? One mile, a thousand meters, or ten thousand centimeters? Uh, one mile? Stop doing the ones that Who died I don't, first? With measurements I don't know Julius you. Caesar, founder of Little Caesars. Jez... Uh, Gen... 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 Khan. Alexander the Great. And... Mary Antinoli. My personal favorite. Who I have no idea. Julius Caesar. How many months are in a decade? 120. 100, 1,200, and 2, 10. 120. Which shape has the most sides? A square, a hexagon, pentagon, and an octagon. The hexagon. Me too. Look at the answers, boy. What language is most commonly spoke in Brazil? Portuguese, Spanish, Brazilian, or French? Uh, uh oh, Spanish sounds it. right. I thought it, I thought it did. Because, you know, never mind. How many sides does a hexagon have? Five, six, seven, or eight? Eight. I think eight is the answer on that one. What is the chemical symbol for iron? I R F E I or A U. What does this stand for? Uh, I R is the answer. Okay. Approximately, how far is it from New York City to London? Five hundred miles. One thousand miles. 3,000 miles, or 10,000 miles? I'm pretty sure it's 3,000 miles. Glasnost was a political party introduced in what country? The United States, the Canada, France, or the Soviet Union? The Soviet Union sounds right. Which is not a prime number. 7, 13, 27, Jeff, or 29. I mean, I've, I've named, all the numbers have names, you just have to look hard enough. 27. And who's Jeff? Alright! We're gonna hand this back and see what the answers are. So hopefully we'll have good results. All right, Let's see what you got. You got a uh, uh, oh oh that's bad. That's bad. That's real bad. That's bleak. What? You got eight out of twenty-five questions right. Giving you a whole score of 
5.90%. Well, I'm, I'm one and a half years you. old, so... Yeah. Your turn. I'm good. I'm good. Just go ahead and answer every question with the first one. It's the first answer to everything. It's the first one. All of them. I beg your pardon. Oh, okay then. Let's just start adding these up. The first answer for everything? There's no way you're going to get that right. Alright. Uh, let's see here. Um... You've got to be kidding me. You got 7.23%. But you only got 8 right. Really? Wow. That's pretty smart. <laughs>